Hi guys, how is it going? This is gonna be our first Rolinia, first Rolinias for 2022. They are not like super big. These, um, the first two that I sent out, those were very, very beautiful. But these are gonna be probably just as tasty, just smaller. Do you wanna measure it? No? Just out of curiosity, it hurt. Oh yeah. Oh, it smells so good, smell it. It reminds me to um, rosemary, fresh rosemary. Yeah, a little bit. Get that strong. <laughs> exactly like I cut his finger. Score you don't eat. No. No. <laughs> no. You eat out the flesh, and there is some seeds you don't want to eat. Wow. Very good, isn't it? <laughs> Also called the lemon meringue fruit, Rolinia, Deliciosa. The best to grow this one, and then when it's ready like this, just pick it and doesn't take super well for um, when the it's ready. The only way you're gonna get one is overnight shipping. That's the only way overnight, but because otherwise it would be <laughs> You wait two days and it's slime. It would be a slime, it would be like a pudding, like, like a soft pudding. <laughs> It wouldn't be soft, but it'd be just think of like Nickelodeon slime. <laughs> yeah, probably. <laughs> Maybe that's why the the other synonym is which most of the people they use the mucosa. But um, yeah, if you, you pick it at the right time, you a little bit of the mucus, it, right? it will be a muco mucus a mess. But if you pick it at the right time, it is absolutely delicious. You can be late though. This is one of seeds. yeah. This is one of those fruits that if you snooze, you lose. You kind of you pick it. You don't even want to put it in the refrigerator at all. Mm. Eat it as much as you can, fresh. It's already turning brown. We picked it off the tree like two minutes mm -hmm. ago. It oxidizes quickly. So, Linko, you want to try it? Hmm. Do you like it? Yes. Would you like some more? You look sleepy, Baboot. I don't know how you slept all day. <laughs> Sometimes when you sleep too much, that's not good either. It makes you feel more tired. Yeah, like mine already went from yellow to brown. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but we do sell seeds. Yes, there is some seeds if you guys are interested. Lincoln, don't you're gonna don't bruise them. Don't lose them. They're not, they're not race cars. They grow quickly from seed. Some people say that they can grow it in just a couple of years. Um, my tree was four years old when I first started to get fruit. Mm. You can have it earlier though. It's a lot on the conditions as well. It's very good. It's like a dessert out of a fruit, no? Yeah get a good amount of uh, vitamins and I sure need it right now underwater underwater under weather very good Does it? do you like it hmm? Yeah, you don't eat the seed, okay? Yeah, that's not the seed you cannot chew on. That would be really bad. Just like apples, you don't want to chew on these seeds either. Or coconuts, you don't want to eat coconut whole. What was that? Oh, there was a little seed? Yeah. Good job, Bobu. Good job. Very good. If there is a. Mm, thank you so much. Yeah, you have to spit out the seeds. That's correct. Trying to, Trying to teach the kiddos with the anonas. You cannot play because you don't want to chew on the seed. If you by accident swallow it, I think it's alright. 
I did it before and nothing happened. But if you chew on it, that's a different story. I know in some of the countries, they're making the insecticide from it, the seed powder, and they're using it for um, lice insecticide but you have to be careful with the anomas and the sap of the tree because um, it can also blind you like if you for example you get the sap on your finger and you, st you start <laughs> and you start to itch your uh, eyes it can it can give you uh, you have to be very careful with in most of the plants or you have to be careful because that's how they keep themselves alive. Okay. Some of them. The faster you plant the seeds, the better the germination will be. I was told not probably it wouldn't be a good idea to plant this tree in my area. Because we can get um, sometimes below freezing at winter time for a short period of time, but it's enough to kill some of these tropicals. I was told that probably I should choose uh, Atemoya over uh, Rolinia. And uh, I went to another nursery, and over there I was told that probably I should choose Rolinia over mm. Cherry of the Rio Grande because it's such a delicious fruit. And the cherry of the Rio Grande doesn't seem to bear that much, unfortunately, in my area. So that's when I was like, okay, I give a try. What's the worst can happen? And I was lucky. For a couple of winters, there wasn't very low temperatures. So by the time they grew up the trees now they're already stronger they're already more mature they can withstand cooler temperature more cold temperature for a little longer than a delicate seedling of course this rolina tree lasted all the leaves at winter time and didn't lose the fruit. It was bearing fruit pretty much year round last year. So far, it's still pushing out, it's still pushing in the flower. So it's a very good variety. Link, what are you doing? Link. <laughs> Can you say bye? Can you say bye? <laughs> Try again. Bye. <laughs> bye guys. Have a good day. Good weekend. Bye.